Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Welcome back, everyone, and buckle up while you're at it because this should be a doozy here this evening. Ray Ferraro's down between the benches. Ray, so what are you hearing down there? Well, two different things, really. The home team's talking about maintaining a four check, controlling the puck down low, get some zone time. The visitors are talking about pucks to the net, traffic in front of the goaltender, try to make it difficult for him. It happens so fast, even though you've looked at the goaltender on video. And the hand is up. Let's see the call here. Now you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. There's the horn bringing period number one to an end. Still no score in this one. Kids, don't forget if you're a member of our rookie team, you'll have the opportunity to have a couple of our players sign up. And while both teams get a refresher, we'll take one ourselves. There's the whistle, penalty coming up. We got a minor penalty coming up For here sure, on this one. sure, James. I mean, this call was gonna be made. You could see the play develop, and now they're gonna have to serve two minutes. As they step into the face-off circle, let's see if they can take advantage on this power play. You kind of muddle along in a 0-0 game, and now you got a real... They score! <laughs> Good effort onto the puck to get into the zone clean and then set it up and are able to cash in. Power play's job is to create shots. And if you can create them from the most dangerous areas of the ice, you're going to be successful. Dead center, in the slot. He doesn't miss. Ostrava's got the lead here late in the second. Give me the strategy here now, coach. It's not to sit back. And that's all she wrote on period number two in this one. Ostrava's got a 1-0 lead after 40 minutes of play. They've certainly played well defensively. What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. 46 seconds left. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. And there's the whistle. Yet another penalty set to be handed out here. Parinka's gonna serve a pair for interference. Too late to the player. Once the puck's gone, you gotta let him skate. Goalie on the bench, and the extra attacker's out for a much-needed goal. You practice this, you're ready for it, and it starts with the face-off. Moroz is quick on the draw. Club save! Sends a pass over. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Takes the pass. Back to the point it goes. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Moves it to Burrows. Handles the puck. Takes the feed from the left side. Slides it back to the blue line. Shut down by the blocker. Oh, and another big stop. Great stop by the goaltender again. Back to back saves. From point blank. And that'll do it here tonight for this one. A shutout and more importantly, the W, Ray. He played an outstanding game right from the very beginning. The tough shots looked easy. He was in control. And he lays a zero on the other guys. Well, this one's in the books. A fun one tonight for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us, everyone. Good night.